runs one of Donald Trump's companies. There were a million people who applied to be on The Apprentice. There were 18 people that were chosen, and there was one winner, the brother right here. <laughs> she was with me right there. She with me. <laughs> so here's the question I would be asking if I were in your seats right now. If I were in your seat, the question I'd be asking is, what happened? She's shaking her head. What happened? How did you go from the hard-headed, knuckle-headed, have all the answers, all the questions, young man who butt heads with his mother to a Rhodes Scholar with five degrees, one from MIT, one from Oxford, and the winner of The Apprentice? How does that happen? You listen to your mom. <laughs> <laughs> Clap for that. Listen to your mom. I'm going to come back to that. You're not that far off the mark. So I'm gonna tell you what happened. Five things happened. Five things happened. One, two, three, four, five. Five things happened. Five things that I came to know that I didn't know before transitioning from middle school to high school. The first thing I came to know, if you wanna know the answer to what happened, the first thing I came to know is I came to know myself. And by that more specifically, I mean I came to know two things. What Am I passionate about and what am I good at? What am I passionate about and what am I good at? Because I never stop to answer those questions. They say that the two most important days of your life, the day you were born and the day you figure out why you were born. And during that transition, as I asked myself the question, what do you want out of high school? I reflected on my years growing up. You know what I did when I was a kid? This is just me. When I was a kid, I sold lemonade on the corner of my neighborhood. Now granted, I put my, my, uh, my lemonade stand right by the highway so I didn't sell any lemonade because the cars couldn't stop. But I was out there hustling, selling lemonade. I sold candy in the halls of my high school and you weren't supposed to sell candy in the halls of the high school. I did it anyway. Nobody was watching. I just put it in my bag. I tried to sell my toys to other kids in my neighborhood. And the kids were broke like me, so they couldn't buy the toys, right? <laughs> In fact, get this, my mother found out I was trying to sell the toys. She said, boy, you can't sell the toys. I bought the toys. <laughs>